I'm Gary Bennett. I'm an associate professor of psychology, global health, and medicine here at Duke. I direct the Duke Obesity Prevention Program, and I'm the director of undergraduate studies for the Duke Global Health Institute. The global health major at Duke is really exciting. It's the first of its kind in the nation. It's a liberal arts major, which means that our students will come from across the campus. We want them to explore topics um, really from across the university, biology, anthropology, public policy, psychology, whatever they choose. It's a double major, which means that students will combine the global health major with any other major on Duke's campus. And we've designed it in such a way that it can pair easily with any major. So we don't want students to compromise. We want them to really study the discipline that they're most interested in, personalize their experience, to play to their strengths, and leverage those learnings to complex global health challenges. We're preparing global health majors to be leaders in global health scholarship and practice. At various points along the way in the major, students from different co-majors, the historian, the anthropologist, the biologist, the romance studies major, will all be working together on a single global health problem, but they'll be approaching it from various perspectives. And we think that that kind of multidisciplinary interaction is where the most exciting um, and the most successful global health answers will come from. Every student in the global health major will complete an experiential learning opportunity. So this might be an internship with an NGO. It could be field work on a research project in Sub-Saharan Africa. Um, it might be work at the WHO. It could also be work in a research lab here on Duke's campus that has global health relevance. Um, there are a wide variety of potential experiential learning opportunities, but what we think are really important about, about experiential learning is that students should have an opportunity to really put into practice what they're learning. One of the most exciting things about the faculty at the Duke Global Health Institute is that we represent a wide range of disciplinary perspectives. We have psychologists and anthropologists and demographers and physicians and sociologists. We have a, a wide variety of individuals on our faculty. I can say without question that our faculty are some of the best in the world. Our faculty are passionate, they're smart, they're ambitious, they're extremely hardworking, but maybe the best thing about them is that they love our undergraduate students. Then we choose to be in global health at Duke because we love working with our students. We love bringing our students into the lab. We love bringing them into the field. We love having lunch with them and fighting about things that we learned in class. So I think that global health majors will have even more opportunity to be exposed to um, an exciting group of faculty who are struggling with the same kinds of questions that they are. And um, we think that that kind of advising is going to make the global health major very special. We're looking for students who have passion for changing the world. I think we're unapologetic about that. If you're the kind of students who wants to make a difference, who wants to improve the lives of real people and communities, then we're looking for you. Passion isn't enough. The global health major is going to be hard work. Um, students are going to have to find a way, um, with our help, of making their global health studies work with their co-major. And we want students who will be excited about that. We want students who are interested in finding their own way and exploring their own thoughts and um, really innovating. These exciting synergies, the interdisciplinary, the multidisciplinary, the real world nature of the global health major, are going to lead to some very exciting solutions for some of the challenges that we're experiencing today. <laughs>